tent down there. Yeah. It's a really cool vibe, <laughs> and gotta love those leprechauns this time of year. <laughs> right, they're Pretty gonna fun. be everywhere, especially on Saturday <laughs> with St. Patrick's Day around. Uh, this morning, a little bit cool as you're heading off to work. We got temperatures in the 20s, but it's a quieter day. Remember yesterday we had a few light dusting of snowfall? Nothing like that this morning, but it's in the 20s. We uh, should get into the upper 30s for highs. It doesn't look like that today. Might not even reach above the freezing mark, believe it or not. Winds out of the north and northwest at 8 miles per hour. That's making a wind chill factor of 19 degrees out there. Up towards Mountain, it's 23 degrees. Sister Bay holding on to 24 this morning, down towards Final Lake 29. Also in Wapaka, Watoma holding on to 27 degrees this morning. Winds coming in out of the north and northwest between 5 to 10 miles per hour, even a little bit breezier up towards Door County. These winds will continue to increase later on this afternoon. It looks like about 10 to 20 miles per hour sustained winds as you get into the afternoon hours. But right now, with those winds, currently feel like temperature 8 degrees in Surgeon Bay, 17 in, in the Fox Valley, 11 degrees up towards Anago. So it's a chilly morning. You'll need the jacket, the gloves, the hat as you head outside. Also, some of you might encounter a few flurries or a passing snow shower. All of these are moving mostly straight southward from the north after that cold front that came through the area. Some more steadier snowfall and even lake effect snows up towards Marquette and the UP of Michigan and even other, over parts of the uh, southern Great Lakes. A high pressure starting to move in. We'll start to see some clearing skies later on this afternoon, but for the meantime, still we'll keep some flurries or a passing snow shower for the first half of the morning before we start to see some clearing skies. Now, that Nor'easter, take a look at it. It's really starting to crank its uh, way up towards the northeast. Heavy snowfall. We're talking rates between one to three inches per hour. For us, we're going to be pretty calm today. Mostly clearing skies by tomorrow afternoon. But for today, a bit of a mix of sun and clouds. We'll have temperatures slowly rise up into the upper 20s and also winds coming in out of the north and northwest between 10 to 20 miles per hour. Then as we get into the evening hours, we'll start to cool down into the teens. And then for tomorrow, a little bit more sunshine and expecting a dry day. And look at that, highs back into the 40s. So if you want a little taste of spring, enjoy it because then another cold front comes through late tomorrow night and we go back into the 30s for highs on Thursday. For today, only a high of 30 degrees winds out of the north and northwest 10 to 20 miles per hour for tonight will cool down to an overnight low of 19 degrees partly cloudy we should stay pretty quiet and then for tomorrow back into the 40s mostly sunny skies winds out of the southwest that's going to usher in that want milder air out of the southwest as well so for the next three days after we'll go back into the 30s on thursday maybe a chance of flurries mid 30s on friday now in st patrick's day looking all right upper 40s i did drop it down a few degrees yesterday i had a high of 50 degrees, but our average high for this time of year is right around 38, 39 degrees. So we'll take it. It's still above average and it's a dry forecast. So it looks like everybody will be out and enjoying the festivities and really not much to complain in terms of the weather per, uh, department. Kind of how it's supposed to be this time of year. Absolutely. Let's yeah. hopefully keep that trend going. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Gino. Still ahead, an update.